All right, guys, welcome to a game called Skinwalker Hunt. Now, we're no strangers to going out into the wilderness and trying to find these mythical creatures, but this one seems to be a little bit different. Let me explain why. It says you play as a Native American monster hunter who will try and track down the legendary creature called a Skinwalker, but it's in different parts of the world. You'll be able to find and use different tools and abilities to hunt and survive. Also leaves you with a bit of a warning. This is not a story-driven game. Successful hunting requires patience and perseverance. Now, the thing that really caught my attention was hunting it in different parts of the world, and it's not a lie. If you click on select map, we start at Longwind Valley, USA, and then we can move to Chernobyl Forest, Ukraine. So I'm guessing whatever we find here has a direct impact on what we're going to find here. And I guess maybe more to come because it's still in development. And if you are wondering, this game is by the same creator of a game called Witch Hunt. So if you know anything about that, there's a lot going on in that game. I unfortunately never got a chance to play it, but I might go back and play it if I enjoy this. So, I mean, I guess if you guys want to see it, then let me know down in the comments. But here we go with a brand new adventure. Most folks don't believe in the supernatural, but my people always knew that some Native American legends are based on the truth. From my early childhood, I was trained to deal with the dark side of the supernatural, and I've seen things you wouldn't believe. A couple of weeks ago, mutilated bodies of tourists were found in Long Wind Valley. There were also reports that local animals became very aggressive, and some people say they heard strange animal roars at night. It was a clear signs of skinwalker presence. Owners of that land became desperate and hired me to hunt it down. Skinwalkers usually avoid direct sunlight, so I'll try to hunt it down during the night. Fortunately, I do have appropriate training equipment to deal with it. <laughs> okay, we're gonna see about that, let's go. Okay, we're in. And this is what we have. A little put-me-up with a box of what I think is just ammunition. And it basically told me that this wheel is our everything. We have health, we have totems where we can detect a skinwalker within 200 meters. And this is where we save from. But once we put it down, we've got to be careful because we can't change its pos position. <laughs> There's already the atmosphere going off. That's why I keep pausing. Like I lose my breath when I'm talking. Oh, I totally forgot about the wildlife. We're not just going to be around a skinwalker, we're going to be around wolves and whatever else is in this. Bonfire, backpack, consume the food, which we can use this to actually cook the meat as well. Alright, let's go and look around. This is one of those games where there's a lot of em There's a lot of emphasis on sound and the atmosphere. Oh. A caravan. Left shift while walking to activate sprint. I would rather just take my time. <laughs> you know, we're just trying to just slowly get into this. I'm so glad we're back. Out in the wild, hunting these creatures. I've missed it. What are you? Rifle ammunition. Oh no, this was somebody's place, wasn't it? And they're no longer here. Oh wait. Yeah, this doesn't belong to us because we've got that little thing over there where we came from. What's that? Shotgun rounds? Oh, yeah, you can find other things around the map, too. I totally forgot. And four, I believe, is the headlamp. So what's this? Expressway is a must. Do these people have gone missing or the accused or something like that? I have no idea. So many questions. Uh. Sounded like a pig. See, it said when we were coming into this that we have the equipment and we're fully prepared to take on what's ahead of us. I'm not. <laughs> I never am. I just aimlessly walk around to try and get a bearing of what we're dealing with. And when we inevitably come across the beast, <laughs> I lose my damn mind. That's the honest truth of it. It freaks me out so bad. Right, do we, we don't have a map. Let's try that. Press Q to open the map. There we go. Perfect. That timing. We want to go that way then. Let's get back around this side. I do want to actually know. Let's see. Let's test the limits of what we have, so I know if I need to come. Need to come back to this area. Let me see what we've got. Into. Okay, that's just an owl. Slot number one. Oh, we got a tomahawk. Look at that. <laughs> that's so sick. Oh yeah. Right. So we do have a melee weapon. We've got the rifle. Okay. Four was the head torch. 
going to keep it moving. I don't think it likes when I'm standing still too long. Follow this road round. See, these are just normal noises. Like, any normal hunter or anyone who lives in a part of the world where it has stuff like this. This is just normal for you. But, oh my god, this would freak me out so bad. What is That's a pig. Oh, oh my god. Demon pig. Oh. So everything is trying to kill us. Got it. Noted. <laughs> Nothing is friendly. Fire first, ask questions later. That's how it's got to be. What was that? I don't know what that was, but that gave me chills. <laughs> oh. Oh no, I know what that is. I think it's claimed a victim. Okay, this pig has got to go. It has to go. I can't have that boar just running into the side of us while we're trying to look for clues and stuff. Okay. What's this? Okay, it looks like we found some food. Flashlight. We'll take the trap. See, if I remember right, skinwalkers imitate things. Everything might not appear. <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. Why does it look like Tarkov all of a sudden? <laughs> oh, oh! No, 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 no. Okay, that did it. Oh, it chunked our health for meat. Give me the meat. Okay, let's get one of those. Oh my god. Oh, what the fu- Uh. My stamina's been destroyed. My health isn't going up. Do I have- No, I don't have anything. I guess maybe eat something and that might help us recover. I don't know where it really says if you need food or anything like that. I guess this might just be like a health kit or something. I don't know. I really don't know. Let's reload up. My god. What an introduction. We've run into a pig. We're hearing every single noise that it has to offer. We've run into a wolf. We found a clue. And then a snake bit us and it's poisoned us. Our stamina is still shot. Look at that. Hear that what? Oh my, they're everywhere. Okay, I'm just going to leave it. I guess you just got to listen out for them. That's dangerous. <laughs> like, I'm looking for a skinwalker and there's poisonous snakes everywhere. Where was that water though? Is it making us hear that? Right, it's definitely in this direction. Let's see. Let's just see where it takes us. Because if there's no water here, then it, it, it's playing with us hearing all kinds of brush and branches being snapped and broken. Yeah, okay, that's wind, isn't it? Oh my god! Oh! 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 oh my god! <laughs> my entire body is just in goosebumps. Press F to throw a red flare to scare away animals. Okay. Oh, there's like a slow motion effect too. I don't know what it was that hit us from the side. It's got an achievement as well, first blood. So that thing is going to attack whenever it damn well pleases. There's no rhyme or reason behind it. And the flares. Okay, we, I've worked out what the flares are for. Can we not heal? I'm just going to eat this. 
I was going to see if I could do this in one run, but based off what that skinwalker has just done to our health, and seems as though we've been bitten by a snake and attacked by a wolf and a pig. I mean, our health <laughs> is not doing so good. So we'll just play this as we are, I guess. We'll just try and take this creature down. However long it takes is however long it takes. Where are we going right now? All right, let's get to that water source then. I want to try and get eyes on early where those things are. Because if there's more than one of them, I want to get that tomahawk out straight away and just start swinging. This just flew up. That was two sets of them. If I take another hit, that might be me. Oh, there's light over there. Really, really good ambience so far, though. I will say that, like, it puts you in it. Totally feel alone right now. At any moment, anything can happen. It's a campfire. Fire. Put meat. Now, you know what? I'm gonna take that on. Okay, so it does recover health. Nice. Can we have a beer? You know, just to take the edge off a little bit. <laughs> It'd be real nice. Are we actually cooking the meat by doing that? Yeah, I guess so, right? It insta cooks it. Let's just take everything in we can. There we go. Better than we were before. Another trap. Let's see what happens when we put one of the traps down. I need one raw meat to use as bait. What about this? Take that. And then if we do one of these. There we go. We've set it up. So the meat attracts the uh, the skinwalker in. Or anything else, I guess, for that matter. It might attract a wild animal in. But we got it down now. I don't think I can take anything in here. Even the rope. I definitely don't want to be in a tent like this if there's going to be a pack of wolves around. So... Keep it going. Right, we've got this down. I don't know what this indicates. I don't think I put a totem down either. Maybe we should do that. Like our first one. It might be a mistake, but... I guess let's just see what they do. We've got the trap down, and apparently this detects when... It's within 200 meters of something. Sense radius. Oh, the sound! Right, there's our water source, and we've got something over there too. Let's kill the light for a second. Ooh, I'm hearing something. I thought I was hearing footsteps. One campfire there. I thought I saw a flashlight just then as well, like the reflection on the lake. Might have just been from the fire. There's a raft. There is one thing that's terrifying me right now. I mean, aside from everything that's going on. Somebody went swimming and didn't come back. And it's not the wolves either. The thing I'm so scared of right now is I'm just going to be trying to eyeball stuff with the scope. And then there's something just stood there looking right back at us. Oh, I don't know if I could be able to take that. I really don't. Got another footprint. Okay, so this sense is like almost like a hunter's sense. And we get a bearing of where the creature is. I don't know if it knows that we know where it is, and that's why it came in last time either. We break this out. The way this is set up, though, like it's not just a, a straightforward go into the wilderness, track the creature, kill it, or capture it. There's elements to it that you need to discover things over different areas of the world. I love that. I think that's so cool. It's like uh, the evolution of the, what we've played so far. I'm really into it. Okay, it's a cluster of tents. Guarantee there's no survivors. There's a whole bunch of equipment, though. What is that? It's a small animal trap, isn't it? 
Go inside the tents. Okay, just a... This <laughs> is a raw chicken. That animal was possessed. Did you see that? Hunting skills came in. I heard a growl. Oh my god! A misfire? Oh! Oh my! I, I love this. I love like the the whole bullet time thing. So it can control the wilderness there. Do you see that? It brought the bear in. It's testing us. What does it take to set up a bonfire? Because I don't think it's said about actually having to gather sticks and anything. I don't know if I can use this one. What's this? Oh, we got a shotgun. Old double barrel shotgun. <gasps> Powerful double barreled shotgun. Because it's old, by default, there's a 15% chance of a misfire. A gun cleaning kit can fix it. Press 3 to equip the shotgun. Oh, yes. Give me this. Got more flares, too. Let's go and get the meat for that deer that came in. Yeah, it, it definitely took control of that, that deer, at least, because it had those white eyes. Its eyes are closed as well. <laughs> the attention to detail. Nice. It is still under development, this, as well, so a lot could change based on what we're seeing here. Nothing inside of that. I definitely can't take that. Maybe trap something, use it as bait. Don't know how long that flare is going to last. Right, let's see what we do. Try and build a uh, bonfire then. I guess. I guess here's fine. Let's try that. And then, okay, so it just auto builds it. Nice. And then we want to cook one meat. Eat that. You don't need that right now. Okay, so you can't eat it while you're. It's just basically to replenish the health, and it's not a survival kind of need. I get it. And those two are cooked now in case we need them. Perfect. Ooh. Feel a little bit safer with this thing in my hand. I'm not going to lie. There is a 15% chance that this might not work. But if we find a gun cleaning kit. It could be re oh, that sounds close. Don't do it, wolves. And again, it might not be wolves, right? Could be something else. Oh yeah, you got that right in the mouth. Reload, reload, reload. It's not taking a lot of health off it. It messes with our light as well. Look at that. It's made everything go crazy with, with the electrics. We're gaining a little bit. Oh, what the f what was that? What what did we find? That's a bear. See, that tells me it's the skinwalker because it knows I've got this in my hand. Oh. Oh, so that gives us full health. Some kind of uh, healing properties to that plant. Let's keep it moving. Don't want to stand still for too long. Like I said before, I've just got this thing in my mind where I'm just going to glance to my right or left, like up here somewhere. And it's going to be staring at us. Oh, that's a snake. I was about to pick that up. Yeah, no, we're going to leave you. Okay, we found a tower. A couple of buildings around it as well. Let's investigate. Nothing inside of him. Oh, these are old. Like, really old. Got a crapper out here too. Wheelbarrow flipped upside down. Oh, there's a bice. Oh, I thought we could have used that. <laughs> that would have been so good. It won't open. We can blow a hole in that thing. Let's go. Don't fall. Whatever you do, do not fall. Imagine you go out to try and <laughs> find a skinwalker and you just fall off this thing. And we're up. Health kit. Nice. Is our health good? Yeah, we're fine. What's that? That is a gun cleaning kit. <gasps> just equip a gun to clean it. The shotgun is cleaned. Perfect. So we now no longer have the 15% chance of that misfire, right? Oh, that's so good. So this thing is going to fire whenever I need it to. Good to know. Let me just check this side. Make sure I've not missed anything. Is that another footprint? Yep. It's over there. Right. We're in pursuit. Let's go. It's got an achievement tracker. I think that was the third or fourth one. Let's see if we can close some ground on this thing before it disappears. That kind of, like, grain that you get with this. Oh, I've got to watch out for snakes, too. 
That green that you get when that clue shows up. Oh, I don't like that. <gasps> Was this the last person that tried to hunt this thing down? Something's telling me to head this direction. Oh, okay. Something told me to head in this direction. I don't know what it was. It was more like a feeling. And then I saw the trees knocked down and then we hear that. This was definitely the direction where that clue was pointing to where the thing was. Oh my god. Is that... Like a little village over there. Don't you... Ugh. That was just one footstep. Like it's made a slight mistake been behind you the whole time oh my god this is not where you want to it's not where you want to be health kit you can hold on to it wait does that mean wendigo or does, what does that remind me of is it the blair witch or something skinwalker can take many forms as well I do know that. I'm trying to give it a chance to show you guys what this thing can do without me just going into a load of detail. It's a terrifying creature. Oh! Oh, no, no, no. Don't get attacked by wolves. Keep barking, little guy. <laughs> reload, reload, reload. Where does it go? I think it head off in that direction. And it's, it wasn't the skinwalker then. I just thought for a second maybe it is the creature doing that, leading us in, or trying to bait us in through a dog sound. Yeah, no, he's still doing it. Dogs can often run towards the skinwalker. Oh, hey, little guy. Wait, oh, he's going towards it? Skinwalker presence detected. It's over at the, uh, the totem then? The last one we dropped down? I guess- Oh, no! Wolf, I need that meat. Go, go, go. Oh, I don't know what's on the back of us. Okay, reload, reload, reload. Let's wait for this. Oh my god, we died? How hard does that thing hit? Okay, I mean... Okay, we just found the dog as well. Oh, that's so painful. And this is, yeah, this is the road where it was before. There's the tower. Right, let's go and get that gun cleaning kit. Now, it might not be there, though. Ha! Revenge. Nice. Look at that. That's what we should have done last time. Right, let's reload up. And we got a clue there, too. But yeah, I don't know if the gun cleaning kit is going to be there this time. Oh, that looks like he's close. He's doing some weird kind of strafe stuff here. Let's go and check the tower out first. And okay, it is there. Take shotgun is cleaned. Perfect. Okay, we're at least back where we were. Should I put a totem down? It can't hurt, right? Yeah, let's put one down right there. I don't know if I can destroy one and maybe make one later on. I don't know if that's going to be a thing, but let's just save. Because if I'm close to the dog here, if I die, at least I can get back to it. And that is the main thing. What is that? <gasps> Teddy bear has been ripped up. <laughs> I don't know why that freaked me out, but it did. Okay, he's on the top of this. Go get it. I'm with you. Let's go. <laughs> Look at him go. Oh, that's so sick. I did see, like I said, I did see this in this... Don't you dare. You can't tell me that deer wasn't coming straight for the dog, guys. I had to do what I had to do. But I did see screenshots of the dog in the, uh, on Steam. And I was like, wait a minute. You've got a dog going around with you, but I actually like this more. You discover it. Oh, my. No, no, no. No, don't you. Oh, I thought it was going straight for the dog. Okay, we're going to just go in the direction where it is. Oh, I have to slow down to reload. No. Oh, no, no, no. 
I'm never going to be able to keep up with that thing. I lost the dog. At least it didn't go for it. What? Is that a ghost? Uh... That's somebody with a machete in their hand. Build a bonfire to get warm. Okay. I guess when there's a... A spirit around... You have to make a bonfire. If we go close to it though, will it start sapping our... Yeah, okay, yeah, we gotta stay next to it. I don't know if there's going to be lore with this. Like, are these the spirits of somebody that's tried to hunt this thing down before? He did say that it's not really story-driven. It's all about being patient, trying to track the creature down and coming across the things that you will come across out in the wild, whether it be clues, weapons, things that have been left behind, which I'm totally fine with. You want to know what that thing was over there, though, that we found? It looked like a human with a skull on his head. Oh, what's all this? A backpack. What did we find? Some meat. Oh, we got a tactical vest. Increases the amount of rifle and shotgun ammo that you can carry to 35 and allows you to carry one extra food and one raw meat. Nice. It's a good find. So we've got a tactical vest now too, and that's the bridge. Is that thing still there? I think it might be. Feeling a little bit better now. Tactical vest. Double barrel shotgun. Where is this thing? There he is. <laughs> Oh yeah, that's definitely- <gasps> Okay, well the Wendigo is clearly giving you some- Will that make him go away? He's not a wild animal, right? Oh my god, okay. Just gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. Let's get away from the area. Oh, we're really cold. Can I stay like here? Reload that shotgun while we got a chance. I think I'm going to have to build a, uh, a bonfire really quick. Let's heat up. Oh, there he is again. I'm going to try and dance around this fire. No. Oh, my God. At least I've got the flare down, so no wild animals are going to be coming in. If I have to just keep going to get away from this spot, I will. How are you still standing? Oh yeah, no, you're going down. Oh, wait a minute though, I'm using all my ammunition on this freak when I should be using it on the skinwalker. Nope, 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 don't you do that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Two more should do it. Go, 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 go. That's all she wrote. And absorbability. Oh! When you receive damage, you become invulnerable for two seconds. Your health slowly regenerates with this one. One health point per seven seconds. That would be nice, but I think the health regen is what we want. I want the jumping effect, though. That'd be so good to, like, travel across this terrain. We're really low on shells, so we need to find them. I don't think I left anything back behind there. And that's good to note as well, if we come across any worshippers. <laughs> okay, we really got to be careful. Did I reload this? Yeah, we're good. Five rounds. Where are we right now? Okay, we're right in the thick of this side now. I'm going to put... Oh, there we go. Consume. Oh my god, they come at you so fast. <sighs> Let's just put a trap down here. If it's following us, it's going to get caught in that. Put out the meat. Probably from the wildlife. I don't necessarily know if that's from the skinwalker. Can we do that? I just, I just want to know, okay? Just for the sake of meat. Oh my god, you can. Oh my god, you actually can. <laughs> so cool you can do that. I'm sorry, poor owl. And I can't believe I did that. I love owls. <laughs> but I need the uh, I need the meat. If it's a choice between me and you, I already made the choice. 
And there's another worshipper over there. Oh, no. I want to take these guys out, though, right? Because I'm going to get ability. Wait, that didn't hit. Oh, there's two. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Yeah, we're going. I'm going to take the hint. I'm going. Oh, they run into the tree line as well, so you can't see them. Yeah, I'm just going to keep... Oh, look at that tree. Every area that I'm discovering, there's something new. Oh, there's the dog again. Oh, oh my God. Did that thing send the wolf in? Oh, it's another dog. Go, go, go. I'm with you. Don't hit me. Don't hit me, please. Go, go, go. I'm with you, Duggo. Don't stop. One HP every seven seconds. What is going on here? Oh, I, I've got to leave the dog for a minute. I want to know what this is. That thing isn't going to stop, is it? Yep. Oh my God, a pig! Get up there. Get up there. Oh no, no. Okay, out of ammunition with that. The way that slows down like that, that's <laughs> so badass. Oh, there is two of them. Go, 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 go. That's bought me a bit of time. I'm not going to be able to take these guys out. Not with this rifle. There's no way. Maybe with the tomahawk, that might do a little bit more damage. Oh my god, look at that. I gotta go. I... Save it for another day. Let me alone, pig. One flare left. Did we get away? Oh my god, okay. My poor... What is it? Oh, he's still coming. Just gotta go. I gotta put so much ground between me and that thing. Oh, there you are. Oh, you look like the one I left behind a second ago. You know what? I'm gonna leave you to go after the skinwalker for a second. I need to see if I can find something that I can hold up in for the rest of the night. What's going on down there? Okay, there's a little stand. Let's take a look. Easy does it. I don't think that... I don't think that's ours. We all, we're all out of shotgun shells, right? Yeah, we've got nothing left. Okay, a little campfire. Some food. May as well try and use a little bit of food that I've got left. I don't know if that helps with stamina either. I'm getting something across the top. Definitely recovering our health quickly, though, and I'm not using the med kit unless I absolutely need it. So, let's put this down. Yeah, we're all the way up here. Why not? Let's just do that. Let's put the totem down here. And then if all else fails, I'll just keep looking for it. The totems are just uh, like a quick alert system, but we can use that right now. What happens if I do this? And has that done that now? Oh, look how much bigger that is. That's what you want to do. You want to increase the sense radius. Okay, got it. Let's eat more of that then. And I might have to use <laughs> the med kit, even though I didn't really have to eat all that stuff. But either way, that's going to be it for now, guys. If you did enjoy Skinwalker Hunt and you want to see more of this, you know what to do. I'm really impressed with what we played with so far. Those worshippers seem like a real pain to deal with. But if we can find ammunition, I'm sure we can get rid of them pretty quick. That Skinwalker's taken a few hits as well. So as long as we're careful, we can track that thing down. As always, though, if you are enjoying it, drop a like below. Subscribe if you're new. Oh, great. It's here. Just about to say goodbye to you guys. And it's coming in. Okay, I don't know what that was. That sounded like somebody screaming in pain. I guess we'll find out in the next episode. <laughs> so I'll see you all in the next one.